10 Unbelievable Places That Exist in Peru Each year, more than a million visitors descend upon Peru's most famous tourist attraction, the 15th century Inca citadel, Machu Picchu. Many will also visit the sacred valley in Cusco on the way to or from these famous Incan ruins. In fact, there are many other interesting ruins, energetic cities and amazing natural destinations in Peru, including the Amazon, one of the deepest canyons in the world, and Lake Titicaca, the highest navigable lake in the world. 10. Hawaras. Because it is still very affordable, Peru is a great country for backpackers and adventurers. This Andean city is a great base from which to go mountain climbing, rafting or biking in the summer or skiing in the winter. Hiking is another popular activity, and treks range from moderate to strenuous. One of the best-known hikes is Laguna 69, which will take you to a stunning lake. Hawaras is located at 3,000 meters 10, feet, above sea level, which some people may find difficult to deal with. 9. Puerto Maldonado. There are two main gateway cities to the Amazon in Peru, Puerto Maldonado and Iquitos. Although both cities can be reached by plane or boat, only Puerto Maldonado is accessibly by vehicle. There is one other major difference between the two cities when it comes to exploring the Amazon. Iquitos offers both Amazon cruises and lodge tours, while Puerto Maldonado, which is located near the Manu National Park, Tambopata National Reserve and Bawahasoni National Park, has lodges, but no cruises. While many people stop only briefly in Puerto Maldonado before departing into the jungle, this city does have several interesting sites, including an eight-story lookout tower known as the Obelisk, where you can enjoy outstanding views of the surrounding area, and Monkey Island, which is home to hundreds of monkeys. 8. Huanchaco. This town has earned a reputation with surfers as a great destination in Peru to catch a wave or two. For instance, some believe that Huanchaco may have been the birthplace of Peru's most iconic dish, ceviche. So you'll definitely need to sample the local version of this iconic Peruvian dish. Huanchaco is also situated close to the impressive ruins of Chan Chan, which was the largest city in South America during the pre-Columbian era. And while in Huanchaco, you'll definitely want to take a few pictures of the unique reed boats used by the local fishermen. 7. Lima. Overshadowed by Cusco and Machu Picchu, Peru's capital is often overlooked by tourists, especially in the popular months of July and August when the city is frequently covered in a cold, thick fog. 6. Cotahuasi Canyon. Cotahuasi Canyon, which was formed by the Cotahuasi River, is the deepest known canyon in the world and it is, in fact, twice as deep as the Grand Canyon. However, it rarely receives foreign visitors because of its remote location and most visitors head to nearby Colca Canyon due to its better accessibility. If you should decide to visit, consider hiring a guide to take you hiking in this wild and pristine area. Or if you're very adventurous, you might even want to try rafting the Class 5 whitewater rapids of the Cotahuasi River. 5. Punta Sal. When Lima residents want to get away from this city's perpetually gray skies during the winter months, many of them head to Punta Sal. This beach resort, which is located in northern Peru, offers visitors beautiful, blonde sands, sun and warm temperatures. If you love water sports, you'll find plenty to enjoy in Punta Sal, including snorkeling, deep sea fishing, whale watching, kite surfing or scuba diving. 4. Kula. Built between the 6th and 16th century, this fortress was home to the mysterious cloud warriors or Chachapoyas, who lived in Peru about 800 years before the Incas. Today, Kulap is the largest stone ruins in the New World, and the site contains more than 400 structures. As amazing as Kulap is, very few visitors make their way up to see this ancient citadel because of its very remote location. It is currently in the process of building a cable car system, which will whisk visitors up to the site in just 20 minutes. 3. Tarma. Then head over to Tarma, which is also known as La Perla de los Andes, or the Pearl of the Andes. Although this charming city is situated in the highlands of Peru, it is also located close to the jungle and so is sometimes used by travelers as a base for exploring the central Amazon. Tarma is also famous for its beautiful flowers. So many travelers will try to time their trips to Tarma for the spring when the flowers are in bloom, remember, though, that the seasons are reversed in the southern hemisphere. 2. Ayacucho. This colonial city was the site of the bloody battle of Ayacucho, which was fought between Spanish troops and a revolutionary army that included soldiers from Peru, Venezuela, Colombia, Argentina and Chile. Today, the city is known for its 33 richly decorated churches, 
one for each year of Jesus' life and for its large religious festivals. Easter, for example, is celebrated in Ayacucho with fireworks and a huge party on the Saturday before Easter Sunday. This underrated city also has its own version of the running of the bulls. 1. Chokakirao. Like Machu Picchu, Chokakirao was an important Inca citadel. But while thousands of visitors descend on Machu Picchu each day, only about 30 a day make it to Chokakirao. These ruins, which are believed to be three times larger than Machu Picchu, are located in a very remote region of Peru, and the hike to reach them is very long and strenuous. The Peruvian government, however, is currently working on a cable car that will cut the journey down from several days to 15 minutes. So it's possible that these ruins will become just as popular as Machu Picchu in the very near future.